jumping off a cliff, would you go to? Maybe after seeing this shit! I mean, for crying out loud, do you know what the irony is? I think that most of these cartoon characters were on drugs long before this special ever came out. I mean, look at it! Garfield's always hungry. Yeah, fool. Back in 89, I was kicking it with Baby Kermit on the LA scene. <laughs> Garfield? What are you doing? I mean, look at him! He's looking at Barbara's head like it's a giant cheeseburger. Maybe I'm being too harsh on Garfield, stop consuming that brain rot in this instance. Everybody knows Nostalgia Critic is bad for your brain. Garfield, you gotta do something healthy for your brain, like, uh, play video games. Like, uh, Garfield Cart? What the fuck? Say, look at this! I've been cleaning out my nest, and I found an old book of my poetry. Cocaine. Ho, 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 ha, 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 he, he, he. Four years after the frightening experience of September the 11th. Garfield Kart Furious Racing is the 2019 remaster of Garfield Kart, released in 2013 on the Nintendo 3DS. So a game getting a remaster six years later on a more high-tech console mean it has to be good, right? Why else would they remake it beyond the purpose of being lazy? Wait a second, this concept is fucking terrible. Why would Garfield be racing? He's a fucking cat. This isn't accurate to my lore. They took my license in 94. Cats don't do anything. It's like making a Peanut Smash Brothers clone. Yeah, like Charlie Brown falls on his ass because he can't cook a football worth for shit, but they don't kill each other. But Charles Schultz Peanuts Uncracked isn't a thing that exists, but Garfield Kart is. Obviously, the goat of racing games is Mario Kart, based on a pre-existing IP. The inclusion of Mario's pre-existing spectacle creating an interesting take on Cargo Room. This game is loosely based on the Garfield Show, parentheses 2009, which was airing until 2016, when the game came out. In fact, it reuses a ton of music from the show, including the theme song. The game has eight characters. Garfield, John, Liz, Odie, Arlene, Normal, Squeak, and Harry. Uh, yeah, that's it. Eight fucking characters. Which isn't good when you remember that Mario Kart 7 on the 3DS had 17, and, you know, this is a remaster. Like, you couldn't include more of the shitty side characters from the show it's based on? Well, there's Harry. He's a street cat side character. Don't diss Harry, fool. He has the greatest prices on East 99. Where's the chef? Where's shit-ass Orson Pig? No Lyman? No Garzooka? Where is all the shitty side characters from the shitty animated trilogy? Why does it take so long to select normal? What a pointless, minuscule inconvenience not even worth mentioning. Everything is food-themed because Garfield eats food. The pizza cup is accurate because this game is a pizza shit. All the cars are just the same, but with different colors. The stats are different, sure, but it's not a fun customization option. This control is ass. If you're gonna rip off Mario Kart, at least have the best aspects of the control. Now, I used to grind my ass off back in the day in Mario Kart 7 and 8, and it was in my instinct to have, like, the boost start ready and do the spin jump when I hit a ramp. This doesn't fucking have it. You can drift, but it's fucking useless. If you hit something, you have to manually back yourself up like in an arena mode, and it's annoying. Fuck. 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 The items are all stolen from Mario Kart. The lasagna is the mushroom, the pie is the shells, etc. The perfume is a ripoff of the Superstar, and it's the worst item in the game. When you get it, you can't back up, which is annoying. When you're going really fast, you're probably gonna hit something. If you hit something with the star, you die. Like, how do they fuck up something as basic as an invincibility power-up? The wand is actually about as useless as the actual fire flower in Mario Kart. <laughs> This is one of the most creatively bankrupt games I've ever played. It's a terrible concept, executed terribly. I got it for $3, so I guess you could say it was a cheap, cheap... Like, what a fucking waste of $3. HD my ass, HD's nuts in your fucking mouth. Fool, I got a better idea. Hello, hi, I am Melvin, the brother of the Joker. I'm sure a lot of you have it's heard of me. It's funny, because he doesn't have a brother named Melvin. This isn't accurate to my lore. They took away my license in 84. <laughs> I fucking rhymed it. I rhymed it. <laughs> Americans have every right to expect a more effective response in a time of emergency.
when the federal government fails to meet such an obligation, I, as president, am responsible for the problem and for the solution. So I've ordered every cabinet secretary to participate in a comprehensive...